At the foot of Pikes Peak in Colorado is nestled the city of Colorado Springs, well known to thousands of visitors and tourists from all over the world. Out of town, over the Mesa Road, after passing the famous Garden of the Gods, a roadside sign points the way to a famous institution a few miles distant. We follow directions, and on we go, the mountains on our left, the open plains on our right. We catch our first glimpse of a wonderful beauty spot at the foot of Mount Cedar, where once was waste and barren land, transformed by human hands and nature into a haven of health-giving and life-saving by that fraternal insurance society, Modern Woodmen of America. No scenic tour of the Pike Peak region is complete without a stop at this unusual institution where during the summer season an average of 11,000 visitors are welcome. Here since 1909, this sanatorium has been conquering tuberculosis, furnishing free treatment and care to the afflicted. From Mount Rose, there unfolds a view of this tiny town of Woodmen, Colorado, where through an investment of one and one half million dollars, 9,500 afflicted members have received its benefits, most of them being restored to health and future usefulness. Within the receiving hospital's walls of native stone are complete and modern facilities for the comfort and care of afflicted but hopeful patients. The superintendent, medical staff, and graduate nurses are there to serve. Patients as soon as able are graduated from the receiving hospital to individual tent cottages. They're small but comfortable homes. In each colony, a utility building affords conveniences for the patient. Flowers, trees, and foliage in abundance delight the eye and soften the surrounding landscape. Stone and tile effects are altogether pleasing to the eye and fit into the general color scheme. The administration building with offices, dining rooms, kitchen, and stores is a center of many activities. The mail is in, and now it is going out of Woodmen Post to the expectant patients. Welcome letters from home. Chasing the cure in the sunshine is required daily here in an altitude of 7,000 feet. Rest, quiet and sunshine, pure fresh air, the tonic of nature here in abundance. The medical staff members are specialists in their lives. Graduate nurses give patients individual care and constant attention in hospital and colonies. When do we eat? Now and how? Each man takes a good appetite with him to the dining room. 240 patients at one time can be cared for with their every need supplied in the way of shelter, food, and treatment, free of charge to them. The best of food and plenty of it to build up strength, one of the main requisites of treatment. From a spotless kitchen to a cheerful dining room, each meal fully satisfies the appetite. A yearly average of over 360,000 meals are served with food the best that money can buy. Flowers lend their fragrance and beauty and are cultivated in profusion. Roses, sweet peas, ferns, snapdragons, chrysanthemums, all rich in their coloring, express the spirit of hope and good cheer. The lawns are the greenest of green, the product of much water and sunshine. They are carefully tended by an expert gardener both in and out of greenhouses in season. The lilies 
do their very best to attract and hold the eye as we pass by to the memorial building, auditorium, and library in honor of World War members. Superintendent and Mrs. Swanger amidst their own flowers. The Holstein herd furnishes ample quantities of milk of wonderful and nourishing quality. Celebrated prize winners are in this herd, and every cow is kept in sanitary surroundings. A bountiful wheat crop on the farm of 200 acres is worth any farmer's interest. And the corn grows sturdy and strong to a good height and yield. Patients do artistic work under a trained instructor and produce many useful and unique articles during their convalescent days. These interesting occupations not only help to pass away the time, but bring to the patient practical training in various lines. Old Mount Cedar towers in the distance and seems to keep a watchful and protecting eye on the tiny town of Woodmen. And if it had a human eye, this attractive sight would be its reward. The ancient and honorable game of croquet is often indulged in as an entertaining pastime. Groups of patients whose improvement is well advanced are taken on scenic rides in sanatorium autos to points of interest, and this cheerful group is about to take advantage of a beautiful bright day for that purpose. And now they're off and away they go. This is much better than being housed in hospital or tent cottages. It's their day off. A short distance down the road, they pass curious rocks. This is not a stunt for patients, but tourists must investigate and satisfy their curiosity about these curious rocks. By common consent, and as a matter of history, the Dutch wedding stands still as we pass by. No doubt for centuries this wedding has been going on and on, and no one has ever appeared with any inclination or power to stop it. A wonderful road, a wonderful day, a wonderful view here in the region of the majestic Rocky Mountains. A popular scenic spot high up in the hills worth traveling many miles to see. It has been a long climb from the canyon upward into the sky, but the experience is ample reward. In and through the famous Garden of the Gods, on marvelous winding roads, one of the show places of the Pikes Peak region. With its peculiarly colored and fantastically shaped rocks, a mecca for tourists and sightseers. An unexpected spot where many pause for a while and sometimes chat with the Indians whose forefathers once roamed the gorgeous Garden of the Gods. But there are other sights to see on other days to come. Later brought back to health at this great hope station and taught how to live, patients leave for home. Cheerio and good luck, a happy going away. Since the year 1909, this scene has been almost a daily occurrence for those whose lives have been saved for future usefulness. Back to the world of work, to families, friends, and neighbors. From the land of sunshine. Thank you.